what is going on collectors optical 20 back for another video today we're going to take a look at uh the newly released avatar way of water jake sully and you can still pre-order this at bigbadtoystore.com i'll put the link down below um let's talk about this figure it's released now if you were collecting back in the day um this figure well not this the first jake sully was not sought after it i've had plenty of opportunity at, even back in the day i'm talking about like 2012 uh 14 15 maybe something like that uh, i forgot the actual you know year but towards the end like i have the opportunity to purchase it for 120 multiple times and i just felt like it was too big at the time you know at the time i wasn't collecting quarter scale there was no venom there was no carnage now we are accustomed to you know larger sized figure like i don't know how big he is i'm, I'm assuming it's around carnage size and i love carnage i he, i have him in my collection he's post up and it's it's i love him i don't know for some reason i couldn't pull the trigger on the first and i actually like the film you know i know a lot of people you know, the, didn't like the first Avatar and maybe this one as well. I actually haven't finished watching this. I need to finish watching this way of water. Um, I had it on Max. Uh, I, I don't know. For some reason, I just never pulled the trigger. Now, with this guy, I he's, he's always on the back burner. Because I always thought that the movies work, were, were okay. We're pretty cool. You know, it has some gimmicks, the, you know, the, the base lights up, at least in the first one. This one, I, I think it's a missed opportunity. They could have put in, you know, the rolling eyeball system because his eyes are really expressive. You know, it's big, uh, it's prominent, and I think he would have benefited for that. I mean, there's a selling point for him, obviously, because he's large, uh, just a weird body type, of course, not your normal hot toys body type you know he's lanky he's long arms you know long legs and all that stuff so he would stand out he would stand out and with these pictures if you have a backyard or you know a garden or whatever it would fit perfectly as well if you want if you like photography because it it doesn't need to be elaborate you know like all you need are plants you know, and then you could set up a nice scene for him with that being said, he's big. So be ready if you are going to purchase him. If you do have a case, like a quarter scale scale, uh, case, that might be needed. He's always on the back burner for me. You know, let's just put it that way. Uh, if the right deal comes along, I would probably get him. I, I didn't pre-order him. I... You, you don't have to, in my opinion, because right, I, like I said, if you go to Big Bad right now, he's still available uh, for pre-order. Um, I would for the right price. I would. Yeah. It's it, he, now he has a companion piece. Also, the first one didn't really had a companion piece. Here, I'm guessing if you you know if you want to create a scene, you could get his companion piece and then surround him with like just plants around him and all that stuff. It, it would look cool. It would look cool. I mean, he's not the most articulated figure, obviously for, for obvious reasons, you know, you want to hide the joints as much as you can. So even his shoulders are, are done pretty well too. Cause you, you, you don't really see the joints unless you're in the side view like this. It's being covered by that um, ammo vest or pouch that he does have. So, you know, in that sense, it is cool. I like it. I don't love it. I like it a lot. You know, it's something, like I said, something that's uh, that I might pick up down the line. Is, is his eyes moving? Is it looks like it is. Okay. LED light up function powered by USB. There you go. It's powered by USB. 45 centimeters long. Okay. Um, sculpture with fabric hair imp implantation delicate fabric work okay i guess not I'm, I'm looking at his uh uh description right now because that one shot it looks like he was looking down so i was just like hey that looks pretty cool but hey i like it i like it a lot oh there's a lot more photos at the bottom i didn't see that okay 
But yeah, this this thing is cool. I, I he has some nice like this is an action shot right here. I like it. Um, there's one too where he was jumping off. I mean, let me know in the comments. Are you guys gonna pick this up? Uh, I'm I'm looking at the hot toys. You know, current. You know, like the upcoming releases. They got a Pinocchio. When was this? Wish Upon a Star. Reconnect with Pinocchio's charm. Uh, collaboration. Okay, so this is not maybe not a real. I'm just looking at their page as of the moment because I was just like, are you gonna release the Batman anytime soon or or Darth Vader? You know, like give us give me something here. <laughs> give me something. But hey, if you are looking forward to this, I'm happy. You know, for you, I I am to to an extent. You know, I want to see it released. I want to see where it's going. I want to see if it's ever gonna go on sale. Because that, that might be my chance to pick him up. Uh, that might take a while, but I'm a patient person. Um, but yeah, let me know in the comments. Are you going to pick this up? Do you like this? Are you looking forward to this? Do you like the movie? Uh, love to hear your thoughts. Thank you for watching. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next video.